Hey guys, what's going on? It's Ben with Resto Tuner. Today we are working on tearing down uh, this parts car CRX that we've had for quite some time now. We are at the point where we are ready to take the front core support off. We do realize we're not the first ones to do this how-to video. Uh, we just got this camera and we figured it would be a good time for us to get the hang of taking videos while we're working and just go from there with it. This really is a pretty simple process. It's just a little tedious and time consuming. There's only a few simple tools that you will need to complete this job. We'll throw a picture of them up here. Um, so there's your, your standard drill, a spot weld drill bit, and then uh, your hammer and center punch. So if you look at your core support, there's going to be all of these little circles on here. Um, and those are the actual spot welds that you will need to drill out. Um, so you will take your center punch and you will center punch right in the center of these circles here. Um, you'll do that before anything else. And then once you get those punched, then you will drill those out. The spot weld drill bit that we're using has a, a point in the center of it. So once you punch these holes in here, you will be able to just set that right in the center and that'll keep the drill bit right where you want it. Um, we've counted the spot welds on this side that we found so far. It seems like there's about 20 on each side. Um, so at this point, we're going to set the camera down. We'll, we'll do a time lapse so you can follow along. Alright guys, so now that we have it off, um, you can see that all the spot welds are drilled off. It's still just, it's just sitting on the frame rail at this point um, while we remove the rest of the cooling and AC components. Um, so there was about 29 or 30 spot welds that we had to drill out on each side, as you can see. Um, there was one that was kind of hidden. And that's in this hole here. I'll try to get some light on it. So you can kind of see it in there. Um, it also helped for us because we had a copy of the CRX body manual from the factory. Uh, so we had a photo of where all of those spot welds would be. So that helped. We will throw a photo of that up on the screen here. Um, hopefully that can help you guys out as well. So, now that we have it all off, there's kind of a few 
things that we would recommend going forward and that we'll try to remember on the next one of these we do. Um, it would be a lot easier if we went through and actually marked where each spot weld was, like with a Sharpie or something, just as we're going along. Um, and the other thing we had an issue with, maybe you can tell from the time-lapse videos, we were using used drill bits that we had used before. Um, so they were kind of a pain, but it ended up working. So just make sure you have some fresh drill bits ready to go. If you guys have any suggestions, or if you saw anything that maybe we weren't doing well, you know, we're learning too. So feel free to drop a comment below. But all in all, thanks for watching.